What's up everyone? Movie Man and Nick here and as you can tell by the sun I'm in Seaside Heights, New Jersey. I'm gonna show you what it's like around here in the off season. Alright, so here it is. This is the off season in Seaside Heights, New Jersey. As you can tell, in New Jersey you actually have to buy a beach pass to get on the beach. If you don't buy a pass, you cannot get on the beach. Unlike in Maryland, it was free. They do have a lot of restaurants and stuff around. It's like around here, they got everything fenced off. They're putting more boards in. Of course, over there is the ocean. But a lot of stuff around here is closed for the season. I think what I was told, it opens back up sometime in April. Also, it looks like on these benches, they're engraved. In loving memory, of course, you have to pay probably to have these engraved or put some kind of special me messages on these benches. I'll show you another one. It seems like to me all these benches are engraved with a message. I remember when I used to go to LBI, Long Beach Island, the beachcomber was the popular paper around. We had all the events and everything was going on, like musical events and stuff like that, and just local area stuff. It is interesting to walk around here and they have these little shops or restaurants or some places to eat right in, in the middle of the boardwalk. I mean, it's just rows and rows of them. I'm telling you, this place must be hopping during the summer. There's some more stuff around. The only thing is, that I don't think here, like, you know, in Ocean City, Maryland, they had a tram that would go on the boardwalk. I don't think they have that here. I think you just have to walk, basically. Looks like they have a water thing here for the kids. Or maybe even grown-ups, you never know. As you can see, there's a big water bucket on top of there. And there's the park pavilion right ahead of me here. So maybe I can get in. I don't know. It might be closed. So it looks like here they have, I think these are lights. They might have a music venue here or something. That's what it looks like, I don't know. That's part of the bar right there. They probably have music entertainment around here. It's gonna be interesting to see when this place opens, see what they have. Otherwise, when you get to the end here, it's the restaurant Soul Bill. It's just basically a parking lot, hotels, not hotels, motels, I should say. And it's just basically the boardwalk. And there's the beach over there beyond the gates. Let's go check out the other end. And in Maryland, the big ice cream place was uh, Dumpsters. Here it's Coors. That's the big ice cream place around here in uh, Jersey, or J South Jersey. You're gonna see a lot of differences between the foods, the desserts, a lot of different things between Maryland and New Jersey. Should be interesting. We got a pretzel factory down there. A lot of food choices around here to eat during the, the season. And now this place right here, Three Brothers. If you ever buy a slice from here, the slices are huge. When they open up, I'll show you. I mean, look at this. You can get your empanadas. Uh, whatever this stuff is. Lunas and tapas. Chorizo. Cat's It's all the food options. Then we got the big kahunas snack shack. Surf's up, dude. <laughs> Another place right here I was told about. I think it's pretty good. Midway Steakhouse. Your hot dogs, meatballs, cheesesteak. When it opens. There's tons of arcade on here. So this is it. This is the Seaside Heights in the off season. Coin Castle. There's another arcade, I guess. Yep. Another arcade down there. There's another Mexican restaurant. So this has to be another, well, this is another Three Brothers restaurant. Get pizza and stuff. But this is the third one I've seen so far on the boardwalk. So I guess they're very popular 
on here, Seaside Heights Boardwalk, clothing store, Planet Candy, more candy, professional body piercing place. I've also noticed they have a lot of these art pieces or artwork up here, I guess to take fun pics of. There's two more right here. That's a cool one with the crab. All right, now we're gonna be entering the Casino Pier. As you can see, the Ferris wheel and all the rides back there. We're gonna go in here and see what else is in this area. There's a sweet shop right here, candy store. I mean, here's some more. Look at this area here. It's just a bunch of food stands, buildings, just chilling here. I mean, this is awesome. And we got that guy right up there. One of the muffler mans. It kind of looks like the guy from, uh, what is it? Mad Magazine? Doesn't he look like him? Casino Pier is now closed. As you can see, this is it. This, this is where all the rides and stuff are. Looks like they have a Pirates hideaway back there. A dark ride. Like I said, there's your Ferris wheel. It looks like they have some kind of coaster over there. There's the Ferris wheel. Here's one of those drop rides. There's the full coaster right there. It's called Hydrus. But this is the kicker yet here. See this right here? This is one of those uh, lift things, like one of those lift ski things or something like that. I guess that's what they're called. I guess here's the seats just sitting here. And I gotta put some cushion in it. Yeah, you can see it. See the green things right there? So it's one of those sky lift things and it goes way down there. So like I said before with the beach passes, you have to have a beach pass to get on the beach. If you don't have one, you can't be on the beach. And I've noticed there's several of them, several of them on the boardwalk here. I'll show you the prices. And there's your pricing to get a beach pass. They have some deals, I guess. But I've also noticed there's a lot of these. So there's a lot of probably some food stuff. I bet you mostly ice cream shops and game areas. And there's Coors again with the ice cream up there on the sign to the left. I'm telling you, Coors is the big thing down here. Check that out. See all that up there? It's all birds up there. Hitchcock would be proud. Also here on Seaside Heights Boardwalk, uh, there is a filming location here, which will be, I'm not going to say what it is, but probably most of you know what it is, what I just said, where I am at right now. Um, but I'm going to do a filming location when it gets warmer. And I'm going to do that, and I'm going to put it out as a separate vlog. So stay tuned for that in the near, not in the near future, but in the future. Here's some more stores. There's another pizza place. And right there is the Carousel Pavilion. Hope you guys can see that, but that's what it looks like inside. I don't know if there's a real carousel that goes in there, but maybe have other events in this place. We'll see when it starts to get warmer and this place opens. I mean, looking at this, I'm thinking it's probably another station where they have events or a band comes into play or a local artist that plays music. Because it kind of looks like a stage to me. What do you guys think? And right here, this is either the beginning or the end of the sky lift. I'll show you a different angle of it. So here it is, the other end of where I was at before. This is the other angle of it. I mean, it, it goes pretty far. And it doesn't look like it's a short ride either, so... I want to ride this thing when it operates. 
Now more of a little bit of a higher angle here, so but you get the full thing here. Kind of the boardwalk with the sky lift, the rides in the background, and then you have the beach. Only two more months, and then it's party time. <laughs> Cannot wait. Yeah, it looks like right across the street they have a big water park and mini golf there. All right, guys. I know it's a little windy. I hope you guys can hear me, but that's it. This will, that'll do it for the Seaside Heights, New Jersey Boardwalk off-season tour. Uh, next time you'll probably see me here is when it will be the in-season. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. As usual, smash that like button, support, share, hit that notification bell. And I'll notify my next video or vlog will be up. Also, check me out on Instagram under the same name, Movie Manny Nick. And remember, stay safe, be excellent to each other, and party on, dudes.